Hello, friends. What? Okay. What? I can't say that? Oh, I can't say that. Um. Hello, viewer, and thank you for watching Apocalypse Japan. What you're looking at right now is a website for a yakiniku restaurant located near Momodani Station. The name of this particular restaurant is Kiku Yasu. Unfortunately, this website only has Japanese, so I'm going to hit the Google Translate and see what we get. No, I'm relying on Google Translate, so English is a little bit quirky, to say the least, sometimes, but it gives you a pretty good idea of what's going on. Here you can see the seating arrangements, the different rooms they have, uh, some private rooms and partially private rooms. Please use it for adult drinking there, yeah, that sounds fun. Adult drinking, please no adolescent drinking. Also this chick space here. Yeah, enjoy time with your loved one with delicious taste of grilled meat and wine. Sounds wonderful. Sofa seats, very nice. Face-to-face -face dining as well, or you could go for the box seat full of private feeling. Lovely. This is the downstairs, and you walk in, you'll see this. They have semi-private booths, and then a bar counter on the left. Looking at the Q&A, the thing I noticed most is that it is a smoking restaurant. Yes, all seats can be smoked. But because they are using open flame and grilling meat, the ventilation system is really adequate and I've never had a problem with cigarette smoke. What you see here is Kikuyasu's Kodawari list. These are points that the store is unwilling to compromise on quality and service. For number one here says Kikuyasu's proud, cheap, and delicious top grade spatula. Now I looked at the original Japanese and it talks about the Hereford cattle. I guess that's the kind of cattle they're breeding because this is not only a restaurant but also a butcher shop. And, and uh, number two is a commitment to sauce that eats meat deliciously. Now the sauce doesn't actually eat the meat. It means that they have developed an original sauce which they make in-house specifically for the quality of meat that they serve. I think number three is pretty straightforward. Moving on. Number four, a menu structure with Japanese as the starting point. The original Japanese says wa. Wa can mean many things such as harmony, peace, Japan, or Japanese style. So that's what they're trying to get at. And the last two are pretty self-explanatory. Last section as well is pretty straightforward. Now here we can see the menu. All the prices are in Japanese yen, excluding tax. Right now, sales tax is 10%. Then moving down, we have a few course options. The amount of meat and the quality goes up with the price. You can see the a la carte menu. Now the prices here, I believe, are for 100 grams of meat. See some beef tongue and uh, other items as well. I also have things besides beef, some pork and chicken, and seafood and hormone as well. Hormone is awful. Awful. Not awful. I mean, it depends on your taste, but it's awful, the innards of the cow. Now, in this video, you will see the yakiniku teishoku lunch. Yakiniku teishoku means grilled meat set menu. It is 1,200 yen for 120 grams of beef plus refillable rice, a salad, soup, and kimchi. You can add an extra 50 grams for 300 yen, which we did. One final point before we get into the meal, Kikuyasu does accept Visa and MasterCards. For all the details, go ahead and check out the website, which I will leave a link to in the description.